Hi guys, a uh, preview of the upcoming Wolves game against West Ham. <laughs> like Semedo is going to be missing the game um, the hamstring injury apparently isn't as bad as we first thought and it's not going to be something that's too serious and um, apparently he was close to being able to play um, against West Ham but I think the club's made a decision that he's going to get rested so it looks like either Johnny Otto or um, Hoover's going to be back um, playing on right wing back uh, at the moment, we know um, Johnny Otto previously has played for Wolves in, in the FA Cups, Europa over the years as right wing back and also for Spain for the national team. He's right footed, um, so I think um, he probably will be likely to start against um, against West Ham. But I don't know if he'll play the whole game, maybe bring uh, Hoover on as a sub. Um, but um, I thought he did really well. A um, bit negative at times, kept on passing it back. But I suppose when you're 1 0 up, he just wanted to take it steady. At the moment, I don't know if Matinho is fully fit. He lost the ball 17 times when I was checking the stats in the game. He didn't have the best ratings either. I think he's coming back from a, a little knock, a little injury, and he's not quite match fit. So I'd be surprised if we start again as a 3 4 3. Uh, maybe Nevers and Donk if we do. If not, if Matinho does play, I can see him playing in a, in a, in a free midfield. Maybe Nevers, um, then Donk and Matinho all starting, or maybe Kundal in the mix. So I think we're most likely to see a 3 5 2. Probably Hwang and Ponence up front, something like that, or Hwang and Royal. But, um, yeah, devastating news that Samedi got injured. He played so well this season and we've had everyone back for once and it only lasted, what, two weeks and got someone injured. But um, I know a lot of fans are crying out for Royal to be dropped. I think it's a bit harsh, but I can understand if they do drop him, uh, not just for form, but because of the lack of rest days between... Thursday and Sunday, so um, we made one day see Hwang start as a striker, and I think a lot of fans want to see that. Ponens for me, undroppable. Hwang at the moment, undroppable, so um, I don't know who's going to fit in uh, if they keep Ryall or if they bring someone like Trinkau in if they do decide to drop him. But um, the other problem is the left wing back. A lot of people saying that the last three goals have came through the left hand side, which is true looking at the stats. Sice and it Nori side, a lot of people blaming both of them. Um, I thought Saiz had a good game. Um, I didn't think it Nori was as defensive as, as he normally is. I thought uh, going up front and attacking, he did really well. But he wasn't quite as defensive as I've seen him against players like Kane when we played Tottenham and Salah when we played Liverpool. Those kind of days have, have, have gone at the moment. He doesn't look like he's, he's winning his, his duels or, or his tackles. Um, so I wouldn't be surprised if they maybe start Marcel just to rest him as well. Again, not many days in between both games. Um, but it's a game really if you want to still chase top four. They always said, the journalists, um, a couple of weeks ago, uh, Leicester, the Tottenham, Leicester and um, West Ham games, um, we had to try and get, um, uh, sorry, the, the Leicester, Arsenal and West Ham game, we need to try and get six points out of them. So we really need to get three points if we're still going to have any chance of a top four finish. I don't think it's quite over, but it's really slim. Uh, Arsenal need to mess up basically the next few games. But um, if we don't get three points from this, if we get a point, I think fifth, sixth or sixth, fifth, sixth or seventh is going to be more realistic. But um, I think a lot, of, a lot of fans would be happy with that. I think a lot of fans would be happy with uh, Europa Conference, to be honest. No, I would. But um, let's see what happens. I think it's going to be a 3-5 two just because of um, injuries and because of players um, needing a rest um, and I think we need to really uh, try and win over the midfield. I know when we played them they didn't look that great but they have looked okay this season and they have got some good midfielders so we need to win that battle in midfield so it wouldn't surprise me if we see uh, Matinho, Nevers and Donk there um, but um, hopefully get three points and um, then we've got a nice little run, Palace, Watford um, that's where we can start getting some points that's why I think that we can still dream about top four finish if we do get three points against West, against West Ham. It's not over, but let's see what happens. Um, as I said, I'm really happy with conference if we can just get seventh. But three points, hopefully. Let's move on. Cheers, guys. Bye-bye. When the wars come out to play. That is absolutely stunning.